So, after years of waiting, the final of final countdowns is on. In exactly one week, the curtain will go up on the 2018 Pyeongchang Winter Olympics. If you are cheering for Team Korea and are wondering which tickets to snap up, here's a run through of the sporting disciplines where Korea does stand a golden chance of grabbing some medals. EG1 with the details. With the goal of winning at least eight gold, four silver, and eight bronze medals, Team Korea aims to win a record number of medals and finish among the top four during the Pyeongchang Winter Olympics. And the medal hunt will start on the second day of the Games, when the men's 1500 meters event for short track speed skating takes place at Gangneung Ice Arena. Though the men's short track event did not bring home any medals for Team Korea at the previous Sochi Olympics, the discipline is still one of Korea's strongest hopes for gold. Most of the finals for short track speed skating will be held on February 22nd, including the women's 1,000-meter and men's 5,000-meter relay. The period around the Seollal or Lunar New Year holiday will be a key time for Team Korea. Starting with the women's 500-meter event, we'll witness the world's number one and number two skaters, Choi Min-jung and Shim Seok-ki, fighting for the gold, while rising figure skating star Cha Jun-an's singles is held on the 17th. Moreover, we'll witness two-time champion of the women's 500-meter race in speed skating, Yi sang aiming for her third gold medal on the last day of the holiday. While Team Korea has been strong on the ice, the team has never won any medals in snow or track events. But it seems a new chapter will be written in Pyeongchang. Skeleton, where racers leap on a tiny sled and plummet down a steep ice track, is an unfamiliar event to many Koreans. But with Yoon Sung bin rising to the world's top rankings in recent competitions, the possibility of clutching the first gold medal in this discipline has gone up. Alpine snowboarder Yi sang also came in first in many recent competitions held globally, garnering hope that Team Korea will secure another gold medal just a few days before the Games end. Hopes for gold will be further enhanced thanks to 19 foreign athletes who will be competing under the Korean flag, an unprecedented number in Korean Olympic history. Korea's men's ice hockey team has included seven foreign athletes in its roster, raising the possibilities of winning a medal. And Korean-Norwegian Kim Magnus is also a gold medal hopeful in cross-country skiing. Lee Ji-won, Arirang News.